Hi guys, we are going to create Angular 5 card application using Prime NG controls. So this is our application that we are going to build. In this application, we cover Prime NG data table control. This is data table control. Also, we cover dialog box control, calendar control, drop down control, and Prime NG text box control and also confirm dialog box control this controls we are going to cover in this application and this is the web api that i already created in my local environment so we are going to consume this web api and display this data into prime in the data table control so this is angular startup application that i created using angular cl now it's time to create model class for candidate and favorite collection let's create model class ng g for generate class we are going to create model folder in that folder we are going to create candidate class candidate model so candidate model created now we are going to create favorite so favorite model also created so in favorite model we have two property favorite key and favorite value both data type is string value so now candidate in candidate we have id name dob gender and favorite colors we get id number name string class is important now we are going to create service to fill this model objects so now create service ng generate is for service we are going to create services folder in that folder can create info service So candidate info service created. So we are going to use this web server request URL to get candidate information. So we create a web API URL. And its data type is string. and we are going to import HTTP client module Client directive private HTTP HTTP client. So we are injected HTTP client directive. And now we are going to create one method to get all candidates in progress. type is array of candidates so candidate array return so now we have candidate info service so 
so it's time to display this data information into HTML page so we have to create components to display data so let's create ng generates equal component components folder in that folder we are going to create candidate list component and also we are going to create detail to display detail information and also for favorite collection favorite info so favorite info component created so first of all go to candidate list component so we are going to call candidate info service so we have to inject it private candidate service info service so here we have create one method to get all candidates candidate service so we get all candidates to subscribe data we are going to display according to candidate array so candidate list array of candidate so, make sure candidate model is important here so now we will get all candidates method so on initialize method let's call this method candidate. so now we have candidate list object so in a tml page let's display this information list item star ng for directive model we have to inject specify provider candidate information service so regular in runtime inject candidate service so it's available to all application now we injected candidate info service and also a component model We are going to specify candidate in list. Now run this project and Let's see what the problem is. Error is no provider for HTTP client. So we have to import HTTP client module in app module. So app module file we have to import HTTP client module. working so it's time to use prime ng control to display this thing into prime ng data table so let's go to prime ng site here click get started so we have to install prime ng component so here 
NPM install prime